do 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 okay so now we can do a lot more things since we're not we actually saved bells shells hi bell whoa what is this oh dead eye assault rifle i'm sorry what um you know that sound when you've snapped on an injector clip ah <sighs> that's how you know your weapon loves you back i got a full line of weapon modifications i'd be happy to show you why modify why it gets you the weapon best suited for your lifestyle yeah like wrapping barbed wire around a toss ball stick all the better for performing a little percussive maintenance Take your basic Deadeye Assault Rifle. Perfectly serviceable. But what if you like finesse? Slap a scope and silencer on that bad boy. Bunker down in a bush someplace and pop off heads. What if you like getting in close and making a lot of noise? Extended ammo magazine and a barrel heat sink to bump up rate of fire. Why is this like a mod tutorial all of a sudden? Only takes a bit of elbow grease and a spot of engineering know-how. Most ships have a workbench near the cargo hold. Ours is in engineering. You could take your new toys over there if you feel like tinkering. Does modifying a weapon void the warranty? A what? Sorry, hon. Here at Bell's Shells, we just don't discuss impolite topics, and W-A-R-R-A-N-T-I-E-S tops the list. If I change my mind? Uh, no and yes. When you install something, it pops in there real nice, but if you want to replace it, the originals tend to snap like plastic toys. Right here for a start. I got a fair selection. Modified weapons are my specialty. So, what can I get you? That is a nice weapon. That's like a direct upgrade to the... Uh... A hunting rifle. Special effect execute? What does that even mean? I like it. Um, you know what? I, I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy it. Yeah. Yeah. I am. Okay. Good talk. Alright, let's go back and uh, check this gun out real quick. The magazine size is six. Uh, Five recycles. Yeah, it's the same as mine. It's basically, like I said, it's like a direct upgrade. To feel ennui. Woo! Yo quiero, amigo. Oh, it fires a lot quicker, though. I like that. Treat yourself. That's right. Treat yourself. Uh, what else can we put on this? We can make it an N-Ray damage type. Oh. Hmm. Magazine size plus 50%. Hmm. Post armor damage belt. That seems kind of odd. Hmm. So, what exactly does N-Ray do again? These weapons bombard enemies with N-Rays. When an enemy takes enough N-Ray damage, they start damaging those around them.
bypasses armor, weak against non-organic entities. Okay, so I don't think I'm going to switch this quite yet. In fact, maybe I'll put the magazine thing on it for now. I think I'm going to put the magazine on it for now. Because we got two of them, so... Yeah, you can always switch it out. Cool. It's also tinkered a little bit. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Tinkered items can be no greater than five levels above your own. Oh. Good to know. Okay. Uh, let's repair you. Let's repair you. And I don't need to repair you, actually. I think we're going to sell you. I think we're done with that guy. Let's get the shock thing, by the way. I want to get that back out. Uh... We'll put this guy back in here in case we ever want to use it again. It's got some tinkering on it, so. Oh, and while we're here. Nine shots. Hell yeah, dude. Uh, let's grab the retrofitted heavy armor. And we'll put that on our boy Felix for now. We gotta get him a helmet. <clears throat> Gonna put the riot gear in here temporarily. And the streetwear. Sure. Okay. Let's save it. Let's keep going. Do the shot cannon mounting, uh, or modding? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. We're good right now. <sighs> Game Morocco, Left 4 Dead, Dark Warrior, BFD, PayPal, Mini, Count of Death, Cosmic Han Hamster, Dodato, and Doc Fear. Thank you all for your support today. Really appreciate it. Das Hibbit. Thank you for that recommendation. Rage Quitters with a $15 tip. Joel with the $3 tip. Trouble with the $10 tip as well, my dude. Thank you for that. Um, I don't Clark Sonius, but good idea. Shmeezy, thank you for that. A $10 uh, anonymous tip. Oh, good call. I hope so. I've said the ex exact same thing many times. Uh, Lawless with a 550 cheer. Cinnamon Tone with a 1,000 cheer. Jedi B with a 311. Good to see you. Sokka with a 200. Southern Snake with a surgical sub bomb. Crackalack and Impalmate gift and subs. Thank you guys. Yeah, CZ James, I I heard that uh that Last of Us was was hey, delayed. But honestly, I mean, I feel the same way about Last of Us as I do many games these days. I don't care when it comes out as long as it's good when it does. Like I I much more care about these games being quality good products than having them get out by the release date. Um yeah. So, for sure. Um, let's see. Purchase a nav key from Gladys. We're not going to do that yet. Oh, we can go and do her quest now, though. Nice. Um, we're not going to do that quite yet, though. Hunt down and kill McRed. The broadcast after Jace the Rain. When might we expect you out here? Again? C &P chicken and potatoes. Sublight salvaging and shipping. Sublight for life. Never lifted a finger. Salvage is a family business. We've got each other's backs. Oh, we can. Okay, we'll, we'll wait on this for a minute. You've been following that series? The Hunt for the Wimbro? Sprout Worst. If you're hungry, you've come to the right place. I've got a fresh grab. How's the difficulty? Of I've been digging it. Mm -hmm. They're terrified to lock in the juices. How about a grinder's dozen? Uh, what is a Sprout Worst exactly? You know what Sprats are? Space rats. The laboratories of Spacer's Choice found a use for this limitless frontier resource. Sprat meat is plenty tasty when properly prepared. We grind them up in sausages, then terror fry them in their own juices. Oh God. Um, what does terror fry mean? Terror frying is a Spacer's Choice brand secret. A mix of 13 herbs and spices, plus a dash of modern chemistry. Is it like Borswurst? Absolutely not. Spratwurst and all related terms are registered trademarks of Spacer's Choice. Boar, the other meat, is a registered trademark of CMP. 
Everyone knows our company and theirs are nothing alike. Is it your own invention? Legally? No. The terrifying method was developed and marketed by Spacer's Choice. Between you, me, and this grinder, I've been through lean times. If there's one thing you learn on tramp freighters, it's how to make near anything edible. Might be that this old space hand put a few words in the right ears, and could be that Spacer's Choice liked sticking it to C&P by R&Ding our own special meat. I might have just spilled all my drinks out of my fridge. Okay, anyway. Just as well. <clears throat> Near about time for me to go check on the trap. I mean, to unload another crate of farm fresh sprats. Let me see what you got to uh, trade here. Fresh from the grinder, any hour. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, good. Okay, so Sproutwurst, what does this do? Base health plus 25%. It's actually not bad. Um, but the water. I always like buying water. Let's buy a few waters. I'd rather have way too much than never enough, you know? Okay, let's sell. Why do I have a discount? Oh, for space for choice, probably. Oh, God. Yeah. Okay. Um... Now this quest is to go, oh, to hunt down and kill Captain McRed. Okay. So one of the things I want to do is I want to talk to the engineer. I've got a bunch of companion quests, nice. Um, find an acid steeper, okay. Mm, none of these are it, none of these are it. Could have sworn we had a quest to go talk to the engineer, but maybe maybe that's the companion quest for this. Let's do this. Oh wow, nice engineering sign. Looks like something out of Bioshock, doesn't it? I wanted to be an engineer. I spent all day in here and not have looked at half the best stuff. It's all pretty worn, though. Both teams have tested negative for performance enhancing stamina. Hi. Junlei Tennyson. I'm captain around here, but chief to my friends. Hope you don't mind the formal introduction. Groundbreaker doesn't see many visitors. Go, oh, nice place you got here, chief. No, it isn't. It's a mess. But it's my mess, so I'll take the compliment. Just so we understand each other, I'm the final word on the ship. The Mardits, the crew, the engineers, their family. I hope there won't be any problems while you're visiting. I'll do whatever I can to help you keep the peace. Good. Don't go making trouble, and chances are you won't find any. That's how I like it here. So what brings you to Groundbreaker? I'm curious, even though nine times out of ten, the answer's just passing through. Now that my ship's out of impound, I can safely say I'm headed for Monarch. Interesting. The powers that be paint an ugly picture of Monarch. Critters and such. Maybe someone in the promenade can get you the right weapon for the job. We see a lot of the same faces coming and going. Most of them board spies and corporate sprats. Makes it hard to trust outsiders. You seem different. So welcome aboard. Felix Millstone. Nice to see you out of Docking Bay. Keeping your nose clean? Yes, ma'am. Been at least a couple weeks since my last nose-related incident. Uh-huh. I'm glad to see you in a captain's custody. Just try not to steal any critical parts from my ship. Not a chance. Felix, embrace your inner misfit. <laughs> hey, not in front of Miss Tennyson. Not unless you're trying to get me tossed out the airlock. I'd tell you to stay out of trouble, but I know you'll find it anyway. Whatever you do, just make sure I don't find out. 
Our body. You wanted to talk to June Lei. Go ahead. What? I didn't think you just... Parvati, is it? That's a lovely name. What can I do for you? I was just thinking. I haven't got much experience working with actual, real spaceships, Miss Junlei. Uh, uh, Chief Junlei. Junlei is fine. Nudge Parvati to continue. Um, okay. Since you run a whole space station, I was wondering if, well, maybe you could teach me some things. I could message you later, maybe? I'd be happy to make the time, Parvati. You can ask me anything. Wow. Parvati, don't be shy about requesting time off if you need to compare notes in person. Right. In person. Sh sure thing, Captain. Wow, great. I I'll do that then. Messages. Later. Oh, your your name's pretty too. I should have said. Sorry. I like it. Honest. Sorry. <laughs> Whisper. Nice job, Parvati. Couldn't have done it without your moral support, Captain. Now, if there's nothing else, there are other parts of the ship begging for my attention. Or do you have any heat problem? What's going on? Groundbreaker's radiators need replacement parts. They're dumping superheated air into my ship. Mm. Why haven't you fixed them yet? Only the board has access to new parts, and I won't let them swindle me into a corner. Oh, is there no room for compromise? None. Every time I give in to the board, Groundbreaker loses its freedom. Soon there won't be anything left. I can't allow that. The board isn't helping, and my resources are spread thin. If I don't get those radiators back online, Groundbreaker, everyone aboard, will be cooked alive. You need a contractor to work this out. I'm available for a reasonable rate. Reasonable, huh? That's the best news I've heard all day. According to my grandmother's old schematics, the parts we need should be in the back bays. Oh, okay. The back bays, am I supposed to know where that is? Sorry, I forgot not everyone knows this ship like I do. The back bays are on a lower deck, long abandoned and a haven for miscreants now. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I said I wasn't gonna talk about this, but this is this is too good not to say. This is too good not to say. Okay, as you guys know, <clears throat> Fallout 76 implemented this new thing where you can pay them $100 a year and it gives like a bunch of crap. But one of the things it gives you is basically a box that you can put unlimited scrap in. Now, if you remember, we wanted that and we're asking for that from the beginning. And they told us over and over they couldn't do it due to technical reasons. But now you can get one for $100. But here's the best part. Here's the best part. This is a tweet that just came out from a game reviewer. In the most perfect continuation of this saga possible, the new unlimited stash box that comes with the Fallout 76 subscription is bugged and just deletes all your items. You can't make this shit up. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Like, you know, when this whole Fallout 76 thing began, I, I, I mused, I suggested that there's a good chance that some of the people that are running Fallout 76 are actually plants from other companies and their goal is to drive Bethesda's reputation into the ground. I'm starting to think that joke could be a reality. Um, well, it is infinite. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Just incredible. Incredible. Just, again, you can't make this stuff up. Um, okay. Anyway, let's, let's keep going. Unbelievable. Uh, okay. Couldn't we try to talk this out with whoever's down there? Those idiots are immune to reason, and they don't much care if the station melts to pieces. They're content to die last. Oh. If you could find some way to solve this without violence, I'd prefer that. But more than anything, we need those parts. Yeah, Narnan, I've heard that too. 
Yeah, I've I've heard that um that one of the reasons that Fallout might be being being farmed for cash is Bethesda's trying to make as much money as possible before going public so they can sell the company. Um yeah. Yeah. Uh it's it's who knows, dude. I mean at this at this point I would believe anything. Like they they're 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 screwing up so hard, I would I would believe anything. Um it's just yeah, anyway. Uh, have you tried sending any, anyone else down there to get the parts? I have. One of my engineers, plus a small security detail. They didn't come back. I can't afford to lose any Mardits on this job. Oh. No offense, but a freelancer like you is more dispensable. Oh, uh, um, uh... Why so protective? Mardits are descended from the original Marine Detachment that crossed the Void with Groundbreaker. I don't put their lives on the line if I can avoid it. Okay, those parts? Good. Once you've obtained the parts, we can proceed to the next phase of repairs. Okay. Well, some, some good places to start, so I think we'll help her for sure. I don't really, I don't really want to loot this place yet. Yeah, it's all stealing anyway. Sealed. Okay. See if there's anything. Oh, who's this? How are you? You should clear out. Engineering's a dangerous place to wander until we get those radiators fixed. Fair enough. Fair enough. Military training and lend your life. Getting a little thirsty. Let's go ahead and some water. Okay, so where is this sending me now? Oh, return to the unreliable and ask Parvati about June Lee. Uh, sure, we can do this real quick. Let's see where this goes. Then we can come back and go down. Oh, I know about the domain name, guys. I know. I know. Huh? Oh, I am alert and awake. Not to worry. I take our ship's security highly seriously. The computer was snoring. I love this game. I I just I just love it. I just, okay. Hey Captain, can I get your temperature on something real quick? Sure. So June Lay and I've been talking some. Through messages, I got him here on my data pad, and well, she sent me a poem. One she wrote her own self, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if I should read into it. Because poems are all symbolic and such, right? It's not so good, but real sweet. Comes from the heart, you'd say? Oh, law. That's what's got me spooked. I don't rightly know. It's about this engine that's been shaking itself apart. Then this lady mechanic comes by and lays one hand on it. And the trouble goes away. It sings. I don't want to get too hopeful, but I'm wondering if maybe she's the engine and i'm the lady it's a real romantic poem it made my chest hurt kinda oh my sounds like she likes you i don't know where it's leading yet or if i'm misinterpreting i'm not much interested in physical stuff never have been leastways not like other folks seem to be it's not that i can't i just don't care for it it's been a problem in the past the folk who wanted to be with me back in the Vale, they didn't... They said I was cold. Mm. Not saying because spoilers, but how's the game so far? Loving it, dude. Loving it. Yeah. You're about the warmest person I've met. To hell with them. Thanks, Captain. That makes me feel a touch better. I actually had another message from June Lei. I just couldn't work up the courage to open it. But I'm going to change that. Right now. Okay, here we go. Let's see here. Talking about old friends, got to thinking... Isabel? Who's... Who's Isabel? Everything okay? They were... Close, Captain. Like, more than friends close. They were close? I don't know. June Lay talked about them like it was past, but how far in the past? Ten years? Last week? Captain, I'm feeling all mixed up right now. Could we maybe head to the Groundbreaker? Get some drinks at that bar there? Oh my god. Lost Hope? 
This is a roller coaster of emotion. Great idea! Drinking solves everything! Come on, Captain. This is no time to be fooling on me. Oh, I mean, I'm so serious. <laughs> Next time we're on the Groundbreaker, I aim to get a drink. If I got to, I'll do it on my lonesome. But I'd feel better if someone I trusted was there. Okay. Um. Let's go get a drink. Save. Co beer. That's right, my dude. Co beer. <clears throat> By the way, someone said something in chat a little bit ago. You see, we had a conveyor. And honestly, I'm not going to say too much about this, but I do want to say this. Whenever you see a character that is not of the standard sexual persuasion, calling it fan service is not really a good way to think about that. You have to remember, there's a lot of different people in this world, and some of them don't feel the same way about you. Or, excuse me, don't feel the same way as you about that kind of stuff. So, for the people that are not of the standard sexual persuasion, it's a very big deal for them when they can relate and see themselves in a video game. It's as fan service as everything in the game is fan service. So just keep that in mind. Whenever you see that stuff, even if it's not for you, it doesn't mean you can't enjoy it and have fun with it. So anyway, just want to say, and, if, and, I, and I, excuse me, I used the wrong terminology. I wouldn't say if you're not the standard persuasion, if you're not the, what has been seen as traditional persuasion, which of course these days there is no traditional persuasion. But, you know, we live in a weird society. So. You know what I'm trying to say. Don't look into it too much. Um, you know what I'm saying. So, yeah. But, yeah, that's 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 the point I'm trying to make here. Um, that's it. That's all I'm going to say. So, and, I, and again, I'm leaving it at that. I'm not trying to start anything. But just approach this stuff with an open mind. You know what I mean? You can still have just as much fun, even if it's not directed towards you and what you prefer. Yeah, that's it. We're done. Uh, so now... Oh, you know what we haven't... Oh, oh, let's go to the bar. Lost Hope, right? Yeah. Uh, wait, is Parvati a lesbian? She might be. She might be bi. She may not be at all. Maybe she's just confused. I mean, she has lived an extremely sheltered life. So, maybe she doesn't even know what she is yet. Believe it or not, a lot of people don't know what they are until later in life. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a thing. So, how does this work? Interrupt your regular... Do we get a table? Stand in a corner? Uh, do I just talk to you? Okay, so... What are we drinking? You're the expert? Oh, and don't worry on the price. I got this. Let's just do it proper. Well, let's get drunk. Uh, oh, you're not my... Oh, that's right! She doesn't drink! Are you sure you want to do this? You seem nervous. Oh, no, that's just... That's on account of my not being able to sleep lately. Makes my hands all twitchy, you know. I've just been lying awake, thinking about what June Lay said, and I feel my heart shake. What are you, Co? Uh, I am what's called cis. I think cis, cis, whatever. I, I am, I am a, I am a gentleman that prefers the ladies. But I'm only 35. Who knows what's gonna come later? Just saying. Uh, so anyway, yeah. So whatever. Who cares? Who knows? 